Hi, welcome to Technique Friday with Els. Today I'll be showing you the difference between the cool and the warm diamond silk microfine glitter, as well as how you can use them in a project. So we use the diamond silk microfine glitter a lot for our coloring with the Copic markers in combination with the peel-off sticker. So that's what you see here. For this technique, it really doesn't matter if you use the warm or the cool diamond. So I'm going to show you the difference here. So when you start to use it on colored cardstock, so this is a piece of black cardstock that you see here in the middle. And here you can see I use the warm diamond and here I use the cool diamond. There's a clear difference between the warm and the cool diamond on colored cardstock. Warm diamond has a more gold tone to it. And you see I put a happy birthday here, like a peel-off sticker. And here you see it on the white. And so that has a more gold tone to it. And the cool diamond has a more blue tone to it. And you can see here on white, it doesn't make a lot of difference. On the black, it does make a lot of difference. So here I put a silver Merry Christmas on there. And then here you can also see I used our uh, glitter border peel off stickers and we have them transparent with a gold outline and transparent with a silver outline. So they combine either with the warm or the cool diamond really nicely. So in this card, this, people love this card when they see it. So these are the woodland leaves from Susan's garden and the autumn is from the Away With Words from Susan, uh, Suzanne Cannon. And here I just have a, like a full picture covered with our clear double-sided adhesive. And then I use the warm diamond on that one because you have the gold tones in the trees. So the warm diamond works really well with that. And then here I just have a piece of the Through the Lens cardstock. And as you can see, so it's blue. So I use the clear double-sided adhesive and then the cool diamond. And then this one this is actually like a piece of MDF. So it's an MDF shape and I made it into a magnet. And I put our clear double-sided adhesive on top. I did the lace technique that you can find in another YouTube. And then you can see here, so this is the warm diamond used on that MDF. So you can see that MDF shines through because our adhesive is clear. So what I'm going to show you is this, just this piece and how I apply the tape and then how you kind of polish your glitter. And here you can see I use a small ribbon here. That's from the Beat Strings one. And that is actually a really cool die. It has the, um, you can cut it with the tape on the back and you can just decorate it around, a, around a, as a trim. And then I added those little glitter dots here. So we have those in the transparent silver for the cool diamonds and we have it in transparent gold for the warm diamonds. As you might know by now, I have a lid and I have a piece of Swiffer in here. So the floor Swiffers, my coffee filter and my brush. But I first need to apply the tape. So I need to take a cutting knife. And here I have the 64 millimeter tape. So any size clear double-sided adhesive will work with this. So let me just do it, cross it over. So I'm just going to line it up. I stretched it with my thumb, using my thumb. Just line it up like this. Turn it around. And then you trim it here. And of course you can, you can uh, also cover your whole picture with that. And then I trim it here. Just rub it on there nicely, that it's tight. And you bring in your glitter tray. And because I have a lot of uh, blue in this picture, I'm going to use the cool diamond. And what I didn't tell yet, the cool diamond, the cool and the warm, are the only ones that we have in a smaller jar and a larger jar. So we have those in two sizes. All the other colors of the silk microfine glitter only come in a smaller size, cool and warm, because we use that a lot. We have that in the bigger size as well, in the larger size. So I'm just going to put it on there, tap it off, and then I'm going to brush it off. And then you're going to polish it. I'm going to put this back into the jar. And of course, with the coffee filter, it's really easy to put it back into the jar. And then we're going to polish it. And polishing means you're going to rub that glitter into the tape and it brings out the color more of the picture as well. And I like to make a circular motion because then I get the nicest coverage. So here it's covered with a cool diamond, with the clear double-sided adhesive and a cool diamond. And this is not covered yet, so you can see the difference. So you need to have a picture that has a little bit of a stronger image. You can also use uh, scrapbook papers, you can use images out of magazines, like beautiful flower pictures, beautiful Christmas sceneries, fall. You can pick whatever you want to pick. Cover it with a clear double-sided adhesive from Elizabeth Craft Designs, of course. So this tape 
coverage. We have different sizes and sprinkle the warm and cool diamond glitter. Polish it and you have your project, you have your card done. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you again next time. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And we also have more YouTubes available for you to watch that you might like.